Ladies and gentlemen, it's me, James Finney, coming at you this Monday afternoon from the balcony overlooking the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. I feel good. I got some color of the weekend, rode some waves, and I'm ready to get the week started. You know what time it is. It's nearly 4 o'clock. The markets, they're about to close. Let's get it started. It's happy hour in the Big Apple. U.S. stocks, they rose slightly this Monday as investors gear up for a slew of earnings reports later on this week. Now, Goldman Sachs, Bank of America, Microsoft, Qualcomm, eBay, just a few of the companies scheduled to release quarterly results later on this week. But today, BlackRock posting quarterly results earlier, missing analyst estimates on both revenue as well as profit. Netflix, meanwhile, set to report this Monday after the close. And Wall Street keeping a close eye on quarterly earnings. Given the stock market's latest record run, the Dow and S&P 500 hit all-time highs last week. Investors also focused on oil prices. Oil up 5.2% last week and starting the week hovering around $46.55 a barrel. But that said, oil has fallen about 12% over the last three months amid continued oversupply concerns. And with no major economic data today, let's take a look to see how the markets are shaping up to close out this, the first trading session of the new week. And with that stated, kick back, relax. I'll see you guys all tomorrow morning from Modern Wall Street saying, go out there and enjoy the summer weather while it's still here because it's already the middle of July. I'm James.